For today and pretty much for the next two days will be the stronger wind speeds and yes, the ongoing elevated fire risk that will exist for most of our viewing area. Right now is a little bit mix of sun and clouds for most of the area. We're looking at partly cloudy and mostly clear skies. Here in Omaha, 65 degrees, a lot of sunshine in Lincoln, but check out what's happening in Norfolk. A little bit more cloud coverage moving in and also tracking a small chance of a passing shower for parts of the area for this afternoon. But for most of us, we will be turning our attention to the ongoing stronger wind speeds and also the lower relative humidity. So all in all, just uh, I highly discourage any type of outdoor burning for this afternoon and again for tomorrow afternoon, especially for areas that did not receive much rainfall as of yesterday night. So going throughout time for this afternoon, that is when we expect the stronger wind speeds to really pick up. Gusts could range anywhere between 30 to 35 miles an hour before backing off by the time we approach this evening and head closer throughout the overnight. So radar and satellite again picking up on some rain chances that's pushing through northeast Nebraska. Here's Norfolk. So again, they're checking in with mostly cloudy conditions, so they could squeeze out a passing shower or two. And believe it or not, we could see a passing shower here in the metro area by the time we wrap up the afternoon. Here it is around 2 and 3 o'clock. I'm calling it about a 10% chance coverage wide with temperatures peaking in the mid to upper 60s, but a little bit more cloud coverage a part of the forecast by the afternoon before clearing out by the time we wrap off the evening and head closer throughout the overnight. So here's that small chance of rainfall between the hours of 2 and 4 o'clock. Remaining windy as we uh, get closer to your evening drive home, mid 60s around 6 o'clock. And overall, I do believe we'll bottom out somewhere in the mid to lower 40s by the time we're waking up. Still remaining quite breezy out there even throughout the overnight. 10 to uh, 15 miles an hour with a morning glow of 45 degrees, lower 40s in, uh, in southwest Iowa. So again, back at it with the stronger winds for your Thursday morning right into the early afternoon. Stronger wind speeds, gusts getting as high as 40 to 45 miles an hour, slightly cooler with a high temperature of only 60 degrees. Now, as I was mentioning earlier, yes, we have a couple more chances of seeing those cooler temperatures. Upper 60s for your Friday with lighter winds. Take advantage of that. That's going to be the most pleasant afternoon. Mid 60s for your Saturday, but we're tracking another blast of cooler air. Upper 50s for Sunday, lower 50s for Monday.